Hello and welcome back to Hardware.info. In this video, I will show you how to set up a voicemail on Samsung Galaxy S25 Plus. Let's begin. In order to set up uh, your voicemail, you have to go into your phone and then click those three dots in the upper right corner. Then you want to go into settings. Here, scroll down a little bit and then you will see voicemail. In here you can choose your service provider. Uh, if you, I believe if you have two different SIM cards, uh, well, you may actually have different providers, but you will need at least one in order to actually use the voicemail. Here you can input your number. As you can see, uh, well, if you want to use it for real, it will have to be probably your real number. And if you want to actually customize it, we go to notifications. And here we have a bunch of different options. For example, uh, the notifications will always show, so you can't send it on, you can't send it uh, to silent. I believe you would have to actually manually delete uh, the permissions uh, to notifications for your phone services and that uh, you can do that via permission manager if you're wondering how to do that we have a tutorial on that so don't worry however what you can do is you can change your notification sound so you can choose unfortunately i don't see a custom ones so like there you don't have a little plus here so let's just choose something random from the fun category because I'm a, such a funny guy oh hell yeah we can also change its volume so I don't need it to be this loud then you can also enable the enable the vibrations so when you do receive something your phone will vibrate or won't that's just completely up to you and also you can choose um, to hide content or don't show uh, the voicemail notifications at all on your lock screen. So if you check this, then you simply won't get to see uh, anything on your lock screen. It'll, there should be normally uh, your... Uh, uh, notifications here or in the upper corner, depends on what have you chose. However, if you switch back to hide content, they will show, but you won't be, if I remember correctly, you won't be able to see uh, who actually gave you a voicemail in the first place. And the last thing, I can just simply disable app icon badges. And that's all you can do with setting up the voicemail. Uh, if you found this tutorial helpful, please consider liking and subscribing. Thanks for watching.